Hi everyone, welcome to Queen of the Household. My name is Emily, and today as I'm recording this video, the world is very heavy. And honestly, it's been heavy for the last two years, but this past week has been extra for everyone. And so when it's times like this, I often feel stuck and I feel like, you know, what use is it making a video about me doing the dishes and homeschooling my kids? And But then I remember that all I can do right now to help the world is to help my little world that God has called me to, and that is here in my home. So doing the laundry, doing the dishes, they may feel insignificant in the moment, but I know that there are ways that I can serve my family and honor God as a homemaker. So I hope that today's video is an encouragement to you that you also are doing the most important work that God has called you to do, which is creating a home for your family. spend most of our morning doing school and then a little bit in the afternoon some days this day we didn't we ended up getting everything done early but it's kind of a balancing act of keeping my preschooler entertained here she's just putting buttons on spaghetti dry spaghetti noodles and that kind of keeps her entertained and then I'll give her a different activity and then she does a little bit of school work she has a preschool book from the good and the beautiful that she does but it doesn't take long and then my second grader does all of his work with the life pack curriculum, which we really enjoy. So we um, finish school and while they're doing school, sometimes they can do independent activities and that's what they were doing now. And I was just frosting this cake that I had made, nothing special, just wanted to make something. And so I'm frosting that and then I'm gonna get started on lunch and I just made kind of a vegetable soup, kind of just took a bunch of vegetables that we had and cooked them for the morning and then made that for lunch.
don't really measure when it comes to seasoning. I just kind of add it until it tastes good. <laughs> so I just taste test it. And then, then w when it tastes good, that's when I quit adding. So anyways, I also added some shredded cheese to this just because shredded cheese makes everything taste better just about so i did that and my kids were more likely to eat it with some cheese on top since there were so many vegetables in it but anyways we had lunch i cleaned up from um, school and then we just had lunch i had some leftover biscuits from the night before and then just some fruit so we ate lunch and then after that we headed out for to run some errands and we did stop at the library and get a few books I grabbed a couple of books from the library myself, and I got this one. It's called You're Not Enough, and That's Okay by Allie Beth Stuckey. And she is one, she has a podcast that I listen to where she talks about political things and just the things happening in the world from a Christian perspective. So there's her picture. But I really enjoy her podcast, and so I thought it would be fun to read her book as well. And then the other book that I got is Love Centered Parenting by Crystal Payne, who is um, a big time blogger. She blogs at Money Saving Mom. And actually, I started this book first, and it's been a pretty easy read. There's Crystal right there, and it's been good. I've really enjoyed this book as well. For the rest of the afternoon, I did get some work done. I work from home as well, so. Um, I homeschool my kids in the morning and then, and I do housework and things like that. And then in the afternoons, if I can, I try to work. I'm a blogger at queenofthehousehold.com. So I try to get blogging done. Um, if I don't do it in the afternoon, then I usually end up doing it at night after the kids go to bed. But right now I'm just organizing some books that we had over here and my son wanted to help. He's always wanting to help me with little projects. And so I appreciate that. And then after that, it was basically time to make supper. And then the kids had their um, Wednesday night program at church. So I just made them some macaroni and cheese and a salad, just a really easy dinner. And then when they were at church, my husband and I went to Chipotle for dinner. And that was it. That was our day. So thank you for joining me. I appreciate you watching. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.